We were supposed to win a playoff game, and we did it. So everybody's on notice. Sean Payton at home watch. Okay? That's what, that's what he's saying. He ain't saying it, but that's what he's saying, okay? And I don't want to hear about Dak Prescott. He's got the talent to be a top five quarterback. I know that's not my voice. I know that's not my voice. You either are or, or you're not, okay? You either are or you're not. And wow. he ain't top five yet. He got to get there. He ain't there yet, okay? Mike McCarthy, he's a Super Bowl champion. We get that. Man ain't one since. We get that, too. Man lost his job mm -hmm. because one of the greatest quarterbacks, the greatest talent at the quarterback position who ever lived, called them archaic. Mm -hmm. Let's call it what it is, mm -hmm. okay? So now you have a situation he gets back. This is what you got to hold against Mike McCarthy, and I'm tired of people glossing over this. He had a year off, mm -hmm. pretty much a year and a half. Mm -hmm. He's got let go in the middle of the season in Quebec. And he comes back. And basically said, you know, I've learned the error of my ways. You know what I'm saying? I got to get with the times. <laughs> and the first thing he did was hire a defensive coordinator that hadn't been employed since 2014 in Mike Nolan. See, that tells you something. It tells you a bunch of lies, just like he admitted he lied to Jerry Jones oh. and because he was trying to get the job. <laughs> oh, you remember when he joked about the press conference? I'm trying to get the job. I'm trying to get more. Just like he lied then, he lied when he got back about what he's bringing to the table. So I'm just saying to y'all on this level. Sometimes the old dog just can't change their tricks. And when you look at Mike McCarthy, 14 penalties in a playoff game. Mm -hmm. You come into this preseason, first game, 17 penalties. First three games, 35 penalties in three games, okay? This is the Dallas Cowboys that we're talking about. And I'm going to say it for y'all one more time, just so y'all know. Everybody hear me? What can go wrong will go wrong. Just wait. Be patient. Now, I don't wish that on my buddy Jerry Jones. I don't it wish that on like, him. It sounds like you do. I don't wish that on my buddy Stephen okay. Jones, who, by the way, congratulations to him. They were bringing in a new, a new Jones into the world. You know, nothing but love for y'all. But them sorry, disgusting, nauseating cowboy fans across the nation, I wish nothing but misery upon you when it comes to the cowboys. Nothing but misery. And it's going to happen again. It's going to happen again. All right. My turn? <laughs> Can I? It took long enough, right? Yeah, no, I, I, I knew he was going to go there. Good job. Can we, can, can we, I don't want to defend him, Ooh. but can we take it easy on Mike McCarthy? Why, doggy? Why? LaFleur, the, what did LaFleur do the last three years with Rodgers? He got buried in the championship game and was completely outcoached in the two other games against Tampa. And last year against San Francisco, he was hideous. Mm -hmm. That's number one. Mm -hmm. How about Dak knowing the rules? And he did not play well against the Niners in that playoff game last year anyway. Right. He did not play well in the game. Not healthy, He's won right? one playoff game in his life. How about Dak Prescott knowing he's the quarterback? Yes. He's getting paid $35 million a year. You're How right. about Dak going to the, uh, in, the, in, his, in training camp, make sure he goes to the rule book and knows that in the last play of the game, he got to hand the ball to the umpire so he can spot the ball. You can't blame. Listen, I understand. I'm not a huge fan either, so I hate to do this. But I'll play devil, uh, not devil's advocate. I'll give him a little break. Can we stop making Mike McCarthy guilty in everything in Dallas except for the Kennedy administration, uh, Kennedy I mean, assassination? I Can mean. we at least give him a little break? He won a Super Bowl. Jerry Jones has won two playoff games since, since the Jimmy Johnson era, and I'll include Switzer. He's won two playoff games. He's been there in Dallas since 20, for 27 years. He's won two playoff games after Jimmy and Switzer left. Mm -hmm. He hired Dave Campo. He hired Wade Phillips. He also hired Bill Parcells. He did because he needed to get that standing. Well, damn it, he got a Bill Parcells. He Bill Parcells did. was the coach. He also hired McCarthy. Who okay. you're killing right now? I'm <laughs> saying that you was this. The point that I'm making is when Bill Parcells was there, if he didn't get it done, we said it. When Tony Romo was there, I did go on national television and say, Tony Romo, even though he was a very talented quarterback, is a much better analyst than he was a Dallas Cowboy quarterback. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.